Yeah, well, you know, I think they have to be the best that they are at what they bring to the table. And, um, you know, I think when Olet's playing his best hockey, uh, he's very good defensively, very sound defensively, and he manages his game real well. Um, he makes good outlet passes without trying to uh, take or trying to do too much. Um, doesn't turn the puck over. We're certainly a group on D that we can't turn pucks over. We turned too many over last year. We've got to be better at that. So when he's playing his best, he's really good defensively. He's managing his game, and he's stepping uh, up and, and helping offensively, but not at a high-risk uh, type play. Um, Sproli would be a little different in a sense that, you know, he's got a, a real skill set offensively. Um, he'll have to score on the power play when he gets his power play chances in, in camp. Um, you know, when you score, you make yourself a real commodity, and he can do that. Um, he's going to have to be great jumping into play, that great uh, adding a fourth man in the rush, uh, and then and then still do a real good job defensively and breaking the puck out. Um, I think when he's playing his best, he goes back hard for pucks and gets the puck out of her end, and he's going to have to make sure he does that. I'd also add uh, Jensen and, and Russo to that mix of competition. Uh, they should be mentioned uh, just as well as those guys. Uh, they, you know, obviously Russo's in a little different spot because he can go down without waivers but all four of them I think are, are real quality players and it'll be good to see him in camp. Encouraging to see Polkin on the ice.